Hi guys and welcome back to KA World and this is Kara <laughs> and today I'm going to be showing you some moves on fidget spinners. I know fidget spinners are pretty old now I just decided why don't I do something like that so see you in a minute while I get them. So I have got my two fidget spinners. Um, we have got red and we have got so, yellow, red. I don't know a couple of tricks, but afterwards we'll do a race um, to see to see which one goes for the longest. So first, let me show you the first skill. First, it's just spinning it. Spinning it like that. So what you need is these two fingers, your thumb and your finger right next to the thumb. Place it on, use your hand and... Spin it as fast as you want, like that. Second trick I'm going to be showing you is this. You, it's a fun trick. So do not want try and go on your sorry. And then try and go on your thumb like that. And also yeah. So pause the video and do that. The next trick is going to be doing it on your finger. Oh god. Um Actually, let's do two. Let's do two. Let's do two videos in one today. Yeah, that will be good. We'll do another video as well. Yeah. Okay. So, and this is you can also stack them up and spin them. So yeah, that looks really cool. So yeah, now let's go on to the second part of the video. So this is going to be the second part of the video and we are just going to be showing I'm just going to be showing you my our generation dolls and some of the outfits. Of course here are wearing some of the outfits. Now I've got one, two, three, four, five, six outfits. And then just a normal pair of shoes. So let's start off with my dolls. The first one is Phoebe. She's very nice. As you can see this is what she looks like. So she has Wonderful hair in, in a braid right now. It's a bit messy, but doesn't matter. And then we have my a cute bow. The clothes have a really cute white dress and a denim jacket. She has a little bracelet on, but that's not part of the outfit. I just added that on. And then these these brownish greyish flats with a little pattern on the right so that is the first doll the next doll is called called Liliana she's a horse riding doll but she also does ballet so I got her in a ballet outfit and that's the next dolls and that's the next doll that I'm about to show you that's their their outfit that they came in and also, funny thing, the next time I'm going to show you, the, her outfit is the outfit that she came in. So this is Lil Liliana. So she has her hair in her a ponytail right now, as you can see. And has a little thing that she goes back, which I added on to her. She has blue eyes, and kind of, it doesn't... She actually has green eyebrows, which is really weird. And then she has a little grey t-shirt, a little cardigan, a dress, some tights, and these cute ballet shoes. So there, that's Liliana. And then, so this is Isla. This is my last our generation doll, and I do not have any American girl dolls. So this is the outfit which Liliana comes in. And then, look. Lilian, Liliana has the outfit that Isla comes in. So Isla has this cute pink dress on, a little white, oops, sorry, with a little white bow at the front. Then she has um some pink shoes on. Yeah. And then she has a little hair in a bubble using one of my gymnastic scrunchies. So yeah, now we have done the dolls, now it's time to do Lillian's horse riding outfit. So the first thing I'm going to show you is her horse riding boots. They are so adorable, but they are pretty hard to put on though. Then the um, 
the button to do horse riding. This is this is actually what horse riding wear. And they're so cute. It's good that they added the actual thing and not just like leggings or anything like that. And we have a t-shirt. So she has a little t-shirt. Then over, over the t-shirt is a little jacket. And then a helmet. And later on in the video I will show you something very very good because they have a nice surprise for all of you guys. So let's go on to the pyjamas. These are all, I all have this, I have the same pyjamas for all of them. I just decided why don't I just show you one of the pairs. Um, so I have three of these pyjamas. I have this cute little um, pyjama top which I don't know what that is. I think that's like a pig with polka dots and a little bow. I don't know what that is. Well, it has that tail, so I think it might be a pig. Who knows? And then, comment down below if you know what kind of animal, animal that is. And then we have these same, it may look blue to you, but it's actually purple. So purple um, little thing on the top, and then it goes like purple white stripes and the same purple at the bottom. So yeah. And then we have these really cute slippers which you can just slide on your doll. They do fall off but it does not matter. So it's good for using, that's good for rooms. Like like at the bed you, you can have like that, you know. And then I have a cute teddy bear just added into the, to the set. Like it's just like a good finish for like, you know. And the next outfit that I have is a roll skating outfit, which is Isla's roll skating outfit. And the pajamas that I just had was actually Phoebe's, right? Yeah, Phoebe's pajamas. So this is the first thing. This is the dress, and it's like a blue dress with a hat on the top, and then it has this design on it. And then the same design is adding on to that red and white as well. So yeah, I feel like that's a really cool piece. And here is the roller skates. They actually move, and even they have that stop thing. So if your if your um, doll wants to stop, we just have some knickers because Isla isn't wearing her knickers. So yeah, this is hers. And these are just like random pair of shoes. That anyone can use for anything. I don't think it will really go with anything. So I'll try and find just like a loose dress without any shoes and then yeah. So time for the big surprise. So I am right behind the surprise and yeah. So this is it. It is the same stable. And it has Liliana's horse in it right here and then has even has that cute baby horse which actually is a Barbie horse but I decided to use it for this so yeah, here it is it's on the side right here you probably can't see it uh, let me just open this part up it's a black horse it's a Barbie horse and this right here is Sex and the Horse, and I called it Saxon because that used to be my mum's old horse, she used to work on the farm, and then this is the other horse, and this is um, Daisy, she's a black horse, and she is a girl of course, and then, and, <laughs> and Saxon is Daisy's um, mum. So yeah, that was a really cool surprise and I've even got this stable, which is really cute and it has loads of things at the back, which I'll show you in another video. And this is the, the, the saddle, which it did came in, but I bought another saddle to put on. So yeah, let me just close this again. Oh yeah, and what's really cool is 
is the gates. Okay. Ready? Alright, so I'll take the saddle off. I even have this fake grass right next to it so that if she wants to go out from this grass. And I actually didn't know that we were going to get a thing, that's why I put it here. So basically what you have to do is all you have to do is just move you down to here. So what you have to do is leave it a bit that way. Okay, leave it a bit more that way. Is you have to attach these two together like that. And then the other one you probably can't see but there's two you attach them together sorry let me just attach this yeah there we go after that so then it can open out i mean so it can fold in like this right and then you do the same to the other side Do the same to the other side, attach and attach the bottom part, and then close it. And now the horse has its own, has its own space because there's like a little gate which leads into the area in there. So the horse can come out like this and go like that without escaping. So I think that feature is very, very cool. And it's good that they added that, so I'm going to leave that like that for now. And here. Let me go down here. So guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, smash that like button. And we'll see you all next time. And also comment down below. I really wanted to know. Do you still like fidget spinners? And also... And also... What video do you want me to do next? So, bye!